Hey guys, in this video I'm going to be telling you how to make the Mac OS X text effect like the one I have in my wallpaper. So what you're going to want to have to do this is Photoshop CS4 or CS3. Then you want to click File, New. Call it whatever you want, I'm going to call it Apple. Then the width you can choose and the height you can choose. I'm going to go with 1024 and 768. You then want the colour mode to be RGB and 8-bit. Click OK. Now go to your desktop and you want to get a picture. You can get it off Google or anything. I've got this Galaxy here. Open that up with Photoshop. Then you want to click the little arrow here and drag that picture into the document you just created. Now you want to go down here to this little triangle and uh, little uh, yeah, it's a triangle. Drag it out and then click Command T and then resize it so it fits the box. So let's see, I'm gonna need to go down a bit bit and then to the right bit. Once you've all done and it's all fitting, click enter. Then you want to go to filter, blur, radial blur, click amount 100, blur method zoom, quality best, click OK. Let it load. Then it will give this effect like it's zooming it out. You then want to get the text box here and create a box and type in whatever word you want to have. I'm going to go with Apple. Then you want to have the font, you want Myriad Pro, you want it to be bold, I'm going to use 150 font size, and then you want to change it to black. Once that's done, drag it out here, and then click Command, and then click the little text box here, and then you want to click New Layer, then you want to get, click down this box here, and then you want to type in, where it says hash, you want to type in 4C, 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 to get this grey colour. You then click the paint bucket and fill in with that colour. Then go to select, while it's still like this, click modify contract by 5 pixels, click OK, and then click delete. And then click command D, and it will be like this. So let me zoom in. So there you have a kind of core effect. And then the next thing you want to do is click command I again on the Apple thing, and then you want to get a new layer so a new layer and then get the elliptical marquee tool and create a oval above the letter once you've done that you want to color that in white which is hash FFFF click OK and then click the paint bucket click OK once you've done that you want to click command I here click shift command I after and then click delete. So now you have this effect like this, but of course you don't want it ending up with white at the top. So the next thing you want to do is click this little layer button down here, which is add layer mask. Then you want to go to the top. So you want to go to the paint bucket, hold it down, and click gradient tool. Then you want it to fade from black to white, normal opacity 100%. Hold down the shift key and drag down. And then there you go, there is the effect. I'm going to get that a bit darker, so down, drag down a bit further. And then you can drag down again. And then you can drag down again. And then you can keep on playing around with it until you've got the right darkness. So I'm going to go with this darkness. Then you click Shift Command S to save it. I'm going to save it as a PNG. And then I'm going to save it to my desktop. Then click save, click OK, and now I have this picture, which should pop up, but I can't remember, I saved it to the desktop I thought. So I'm going to resave that to desktop, where format, PNG, OK, replace, click OK, and then here it is down here, click the spacebar and you can see a preview of it, and that's what it looks like. Now I'm going to set this as my background to show you a big uh, screen. This won't fit exactly because I did not do the screen size measurements, I think. So it won't fit exactly perfectly. So then go to, then you can make, click the little plus button and then you can click that. And there you go, there is the effect. It wouldn't normally be that blurry. It's because, hell, fit to screen. It's because I did it smaller than it should actually be.
but there you go guys that is the effects and that is how to do it hope you enjoyed it hope this helps comment rate subscribe see ya